Hi there, welcome to Be A Surface Pro. Today's Surface Pro tip is charge your Surface with USB-C 2020 update. We did a video about charging your Surface via USB-C back in May 2019. In that video, we showed you how you could use quite a bulky USB-C to Surface Connect dongle to charge your Surface. And that was before the Surface Pro 7 and the Surface Laptop 3 came out in October. So it's time to update this for 2020. Now all of the current Surface devices have a USB-C port built in. So if you have any one of those current devices, you no longer need that bulky Surface Connect dongle for this to work. So what do we need to charge via USB-C? Well, we need a charger that's capable of the PD or power delivery charging standard. Not any old USB-C charger will do. The chances are your mobile phone charger will not work. You'll need a PD charger that has a minimum output of 18 watts. But 18 watts will actually only get you charging while your surface is off. So you really need a charger that's capable of a minimum of 30 watts. To make this work, last year I picked up a 20,000 milliamp Xiaomi battery pack that had PD charging at 45 watts. So with that battery, I could get about one and a half full charges or about two typical workday cycles from that battery. With this battery pack, there were two old style USB-A ports and one USB-C. So I thought I'd be able to get the old USB-A to C cable that I had, but I quickly learned that PD charging is only supported using USB-C. So you'll need a USB-C to C cable to make this happen. I also picked up a car charger on eBay that does USB PD charging. 45 watts and I have an LG monitor that has a USB-C port and it charges with PD at 60 watts. So the key thing to look for if you want to charge your surface from a USB-C power source is PD charging at a minimum of 30 watts. We'll put some links below to some products that do meet those requirements on Amazon using our affiliate links below. Stop the press, hold the phone, since we shot this video, I got a comment on the channel on another video that talked about this uh, Surface Connect module and somebody offered to buy it from me. Well, unfortunately I can't sell this one. This is the only one I've got. But the reason they wanted to buy it is you can no longer get this thing. I since have discovered that there's some alternatives to this. So even though we've talked about it in this video, you don't have to go and get one of these Surface Connects if you just want to charge your Surface via a power pack with a USB-C port. Instead, you can actually go on eBay and you can get these cheap little cables. It's a USB-C to Surface Connect cable. Pretty dodgy, um, a little bit poor, poorly packaged and so forth, but you could try one of those out. Also, just after we shot this video, I got contacted by a company called Jago Tech. Now they make this particular cable here, which is a Surface Connect to USB-C cable. Much simpler, much better than that Surface Connect dongle. So you don't actually have to use the Surface Connect dongle. You can use one of these to charge your Surface. We're going to test the two out and compare them. Uh, so far, just looking at the packaging, you can tell the Jago Tech people have done a lot better work in packaging and quality. There's even some instructions in the package there. But we'll do a video reviewing these two cables and examining what devices you can actually charge with these. Because the Jago Tech people are saying that we can even charge a Surface Pro 4 or any of the models with the Surface Connect and a USB-C power pack. So we'll check that out, try it out and see if it works. Um, and we'll just compare the quality of both of those cables as well. So that'll be a good alternative. In the meantime, we'll put a link to those products in the description below. And if we like this product, we're actually looking at carrying it for our Australian customers so that you'll be able to buy it locally through us. I really love being able to charge my Surface Pro X and the Surface Pro 7 with a power bank using that USB-C cable. If you used to be a mobile worker, and if you ever get a chance to leave quarantine again, it might be worth picking up one of those. It's really handy to have in your kit. If you found this tip helpful, remember to give us the thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Surface Pro tips. I really love being able to charge my Surface Pro X and my Surface Pro 7. <laughs> I'm going to get the giggles now. That's <laughs> just going to my head. Yeah. Why can't I say this?